good afternoon. It's a little bit late in the afternoon here from the parking lot at Six Flags Over Georgia, walking beside Batman and out George here. Michael, which is yeah. the first coaster that Ty ever rode that went upside down. So. And it is the fourth world coaster I've ever had a whoop de Yeah. And we are, yeah, Ty's first coaster ever was well, had, had an inversion. So he's just completely used to them. Um, we are here late in the day. We're meeting some friends. This is our first time here at our hometown park For a while. in about two years, maybe a little more. Um, definitely the first time we've gotten it on camera for you guys, but we're gonna take you around Six Flags Over Georgia and show you what it has to offer for those of y'all that have never been here or it's been a while. So come along with us. All right, we are in the park, ready to go. We got the sign, we're up front. You got the flags. There's the entrance. Time to have fun. You've got the Georgia Scorcher right there, stand-up coaster. You've got big, huge Goliath above that. And then over here, you got the Twisted Cyclone, which is where I believe we're heading first. All right, first ride of the night is the Twisted Cyclone. It is at night. Or the afternoon, the evening, whatever. Riding with Ty, it's Ty's first time. Chad's in front of me. Charlie and Mia in front of Chad. All the warning signs. Time to ride, and here we go. Let's get twisted. Woo! <laughs> And there's the entrance to Twisted Cyclone that we just rode. This is fairly new here. It's only been open a couple of years. Um, it used to be the Georgia Cyclone, which was just an old, big, wooden coaster. Um, and it was one of the older coasters here in the park. And then like they've done with a lot of old wooden coasters, they've ma maxed it up. I think this, I think this was made by, uh, I could be wrong, but I'm wanting to say Mock Rides. Um, if it wasn't Mock, it was another one that does these uh, specific coasters using the metal. Um, like Guazi at Bush Gardens down in Tampa. And that was Ty's first time on it. He really enjoyed it, which is great. And now we're gonna walk and see where we end up next. Next ride up is the mine train, the Dahlonega mine train. Another really, really, really old ride here. It's almost like a rite of passage here in Georgia that the mine train is like everybody's first roller coaster. It's, <laughs> you'll see, it's rough. The world's rough. Yeah, it's extremely rough. A lot rougher than what we just got off but still a lot of fun. But next thing you'll see is some GoPro footage.
because you were younger. And we're off that in one piece. I'm not. <laughs> Chad, Chad took a header off the GoPro uh, while we were in that last mine, apparently. Um, the girls sat in the very back and came off laughing because the poor guy in front of them lost his hat on the ride. So they need a, uh, they need a good Big Thunder reference on there. If you're wearing your hats and glasses, best remove them because they coming off on the mine train. All right, we're gonna keep on walking, see where we end up. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. This is awful, this is a travesty. You can't not come to Six Flags and not ride the Monster Mansion. What song am I gonna have stuck in my head the rest of the day? There's some good, good, good history with this ride too. It's one of the ones that's been here from the beginning. Yeah, I hope it's open the next time we come. Here lay the remnants. Yep, rest in peace, Splash Water Falls. One of the only three water type rides that were here. Another original one. We're gonna make our way over to Metropolis because the girls wanna ride Superman, but I think we're gonna do the Hanson cars first, which are the old timey cars. Another one that's been over here with the carousel for quite some time. Here we are at the entrance to the Hanson rides. Our old timey cars that we love. Have to figure out how we're gonna split up. So Mia's gonna drive Charlie and Ty, and then Chad and me and Miss Carolyn will ride Mia, in the you? other car. Mia, Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Thank you. All right, Chad and I are being chauffeured around by Miss Carolyn. He wanted her to drive. Blue what? Blue the Blue Hawk? Yeah, whatever it's Yeah, called. the Blue Hawk. What used to be the Ninja right through there. One of my favorites. There's the big swings. Oh no, is your driving going to make a seasick? <laughs> Makes you feel like you're driving? I like down we're... 20. <laughs> yeah, this is nothing like 20. This is, more... this is more like driving through uh, Kinsaw Mountain Battlefield. <laughs> really? Yeah, like the National Park there. What we got down there the lemonade stand. Where? Do you see superhero friends? Joker and uh, Monster Master closed. Joker yeah. too. Hopefully they won't be closed for long. I see the girl. Apparently. After this, we'll head to Metropolis. All right, we had a pit stop because. Given to Yep, Chad was tired and dehydrated. So we got our cups, we got our season long cups here. They have a really good deal on this. It doesn't sound like Your it out the front, but, but if you buy three or more of these, the cost is like $30 a cup. 
but you can refill, refill, refill. Play you. Can refill them all season long. And so that's what we did. We bought three cups. We already have some of these. I think we have the 2021. Yeah, we've got, but you can't use them year to year. So they're only good for the year. Yeah, that's why they put the year on them. Yeah, they, they don't, the they is, don't stay the same like Universal's cups and things like that. You gotta, you gotta buy small. the cups. Bad thing they, is, they definitely are. They're smaller than Six Flags in years past too. The bad thing is they don't sell the plastic straws anymore. They don't mm -hmm. sell paper straws. Luckily, I think we still have long straws enough to cover this cup. And then Ty got chocolate chip cookie dough. Ty got rainbow, which I'm eating the rest of. Mia, what did y'all get again? Um, I got banana pudding and she got rainbow ice. All right. And then Charlie drank all their drink already, so she's back getting another one. I did not say it. Snack time is over. We're out here in front of the Hall of Justice in Metropolis. And we are going to go through and ride and play the battle for Metropolis. Men in Black. Men in Black alien attack. Why can we do the flash pass? Because we don't have the flash pass. Yeah, but we could like scoot to the top. Yeah, we could. I would think so. Truth, courage, like we're, like, hope, justice. I am Bat Dad. Inside the Hall of Justice, you've got Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. The Justice League symbol right above the door. And then you have the super fun ride. Didn't film anything on it because we were shooting it up because it is like a Men in Black meets like Transformers at Universal is the best way I can describe it. But pretty cool, pretty fun. Oh, thunder clouds and thunder going off. I think we're gonna check out Superman. Okay, heading right next door. We're gonna ride Superman. Just Charlie, Chad, and me. This tie's not tall enough. And Mia and Miss Carolyn gonna sit this one out. Chad has never ridden this. Yeah, last well, time I came, I was tall enough for Goliath, but I, they put me on uneven ground during the measuring. So, I wasn't tall enough. Surprise! Sometimes uh, God has other plans, and the weather decided to turn bad. Uh, you might have heard in the clip of us walking out of Justice League a, a big roar of thunder. And so, when we got up to Superman, they had closed it down. Uh, and then we realized that every roller coaster in the park and the vast majority of Six Flags rides are outside. Um, everything was stopped, got a lightning storm, a brief rainstorm. So as you can see, all of us headed to the house because uh, we got, I wouldn't say soaked, but we got pretty wet on the way out of there. But that was a very, very, very fun trip. So happy that our friends could meet up with us and go with us there. Um, hopefully it's the first of many trips uh, to Six Flags and its uh, partner, Water Park, Whitewater, um, this summer. Um, hope to do that many more times with the boys and our friends um, since all of us got season passes. But thank you so much for tuning in. We really appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like down below as it goes a long way to help us and the channel here. And if it's, if it's your first time, welcome. Hope you enjoyed this. And hope you'll tune in to many of our other vlogs or Let's Play videos that we do here on the channel. Until next time, what's your why?